Hello again, and welcome back to the card mat. Uh, I've just seen a performance of this on another channel. And I mean, I've only just seen a performance of this on another channel. Conjuring Magics. I'll put a link in the description box so you can go over there and check them out. Give them a bit of support. Uh, very nice effect. Very easy to do as well. Very easy. It's basically self-working. Apart from one thing that you have to do. You have to split your packing in half that's all you have to do yeah there's the top there's the bottom card from the middle queen queen of diamonds is there a card you will take it and put it on top of that packet and you will cover it with that packet you with me so far if not i will put an explanation at the end and um, you then deal four piles each pile will contain 13 cards, since there's 52 cards in a packet, I'm splitting it into 4. Because 4 times 13 is 52. And 52 divided by 4 is 13. And 52 divided by 13 is 4. Look at that, you're getting an education here. Not much of one like but an education. Right, now... Can you remember what the card was? Because I haven't got a clue. I've been talking too much. What card did we put to? Um, let's see if it's in this one anyway. It was the Queen of Diamonds. And no, she's not in that one. We can get rid of that packet. Look through this one. There she is. She's in, the, in this one. Now... In the real world, I wouldn't know what that was, but for this I had to know what it was, otherwise I wouldn't know which packet it was in, right? But in the real world, I wouldn't see that. I can get rid of them. I can now take this packet, I can deal this packet into four more piles. Hmm. And that one seems to have an odd card, so we'll get rid of that. That then leaves us with three piles, right? You want to pick two piles? You want to pick them two? Okay, we'll get rid of that one. Do you want to pick one pile? You want to pick that one? Okay, we'll get rid of that one. That now leaves us with three cards. I'll tell you what. For every, We're going to do some magic. Why not? We're going to do some magic. So for every letter in the word of magic, I want you to stick a card to the bottom until you get to the last letter of the word magic. And you can turn that card over. And you'll go M and put that to the bottom. You go A and put that to the bottom. You go G and put that to the bottom. You go I and put that to the bottom. And this is going to be wrong. You turn that card over. No, it wasn't. It was actually right. You get to the selection. Play a card. And that was the effect. As I say, very nice. And as I say, very easy to do, so I won't bore you with, I mean, you probably worked it out from that. You do have to split your packet exactly into half, so you do need to get 26 cards in each packet. If you're not too sure you are going to cut 26 cards, beforehand, count 3, 6, 9, 12, 15, 18, 21, 24, 26 cards and just remember what that bottom card is in this case the ten of clubs stick it on the top of the packet then when you say you're cutting your packet into half you've got a couple of goals because you just keep going till you see the ten of clubs as the bottom card on the top packet and then you can just go from there split the packets they look at that one that goes on top of that one that goes on the top. we get to the queen of hearts this time oh very nice and well, you know where it went from there. Self working. End anyway you like when you got the three cards on the table. Or just the three packets on the table. Anyway you like. Anyway you like. Their card will always be the middle one in the middle pile. We head out from there. Anyway, I'm gonna shut my face and get off. I do hope you enjoyed it. Don't forget, go and check out Conjuring Magics, link in the description box. And I'll see you again soon. Thank you.